Okay, that's where I came from. Jimbo. What? Yeah, I see it. What's that? Uh huh. Oh my! Wow. What the f- That right there makes no sense to me. You don't love me anymore. Whoa. Man, I tell you, man, this game is a trip. It is a trip. Make it. <laughs> Was that a head? Oh man. Oh my god. Well, at least he opened the door for me. That's a no go. Ah, battery. Batteries make me feel extra special. I just want to put that out there, man. dead guy figures what the really dude fucking weirdo man oh, I gotta drop down or something
He looks nervous. I would like to kill him. Oh shit. Yes, would I. Close that door. Keep it moving, Pimp Juice. Damn. Just a butt naked Flintstone ball slinging Negroes, man. With some meat cleavers in their hand. One dude got a machete. And I gotta go out there. <clears throat> so not cool. Oh my, they jacked you all the way up, man. <clears throat> Whoa, I see bodies. One and two. Door. Shit. Uh, go. Oh. Oh. What the hell? Ah! What the f The damn Wow. Oh, shit, here they come. Ah! Let me through, let me through, let me oh <sighs> Upper ladder. Safe zone. Good riddance. Good riddance. <laughs> Fuck these documents. Give me some batteries, G. <clears throat> Kurt, we've got another one, and I'm not sure you're going to be able to check it off as psychopathic proximity disorder. Security guard all the way up in that admin block is our latest non-patient employee to start seeing Wernicke's fairy tales. He was never directly exposed to the engine, never even made it below level one in the building. It would be enormous, an enormous breach of protocol and security if doctors were speaking off of the wall rider within hearing of a contracted security guard and seems vanish vanishingly vanishingly uh, improbable that he would stumble onto such an obscure mythological story on its own. It's too similar to the Dr. S Samuel Case or the others before him. It's one thing for formerly sane medical personnel to fall under the delusions of their patients. It's another thing entirely for those beliefs to be I don't know. Airborne. We need to talk in person. Billings. Vanishingly. Huh. 
<clears throat> He's playing along and losing. What? <laughs> that is what the game is. There is a mathematical proof if you add 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 and so on up to infinity, you can arrive at an answer. If you stop shy of infinity, you have an indescribably large number. If you continue all the way to infinity, you arrive at 1 1 12th negative 0 0.8 and blah blah blah. 3 repeating, I'm losing my grip on things. I'm thinking about the drive here 400 miles and the rented truck, the job that shows up just in time to cover our bills, our debts, the insurance, the boys sleeping in the back, nothing but AM radio, gospel, country, western, late night, what's that, par paranoid, paranoid talk radio, what? We sang Patsy Cline songs in life, yeah, Mark Warning numbers, possible in headlights, I don't want to die here. Okay. Oh, oh Science, but it's not. They were waiting for us in this place. Billy understood. They've always been here. All right. Whatever you said. Dude got some huge forearms, man. bad for you, buddy. Sorry for you. Okay. What the f- There's random dudes everywhere, man. Yeah, I just want to get this radio, man. Last time I seen a chalkboard, there was batteries on that boy. There's really not a lot of batteries in this game, man. Okay, there's the radio. Kill you like right now. I'm sick of this dude, man. Waylon, you couldn't just, couldn't just keep your mouth shut. Couldn't just play along. Do me a favor and die here, Park. Hell no. Get up. 
Get up, man. Shit. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh, he got me. <laughs> 